Hey there everyone and how you doing today? And welcome to another episode of Jay's Horror Games That Slay. Today I'm bringing you The Torture House Chapter 1. You're a beautiful blonde who set out to fulfill your dreams of becoming a model. But instead, we get Manhunt meets Saw. And it's as awesome as it sounds. <laughs> Fetish hardcore, real deaths, ultra violent, violent entertainment, no censorship or cuts, brutal murders on camera. What the freak are we playing? Whoa, I'm just over here reading, chillaxing, and then it just boots up. Uh oh, what am I gonna do? In September 1994, Victoria Atkins, a young, inspiring model, was traveling. Cook County, Texas, in search of job opportunities, and she sadly disappeared. While it was initially believed she had simply become lost on the road, days passed without any sign of her. But what no one could imagine were the horrors of ultraviolence she would experience in the place that could easily be described as hell, the torture house. I'm exhausted after this trip. I just want to go to my room and put my things away. My key has the number 107 on it. La, 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 la. What's this say? Can you read it? No. Warning, do not talk to strangers. Okay. Hey, a Jansport backpack. I used to have something like that. Hey, I like this. This is like super 80s, 90s. I love the retro stuff. All right, we're looking for 103, we're looking for 107, which of course is down here. Get ready, everyone. Right here. It's my room, 107. It's locked. Well, I thought you said you had a key. The key is in my pocket. Oh, is this one of those, like... Yeah, I for inventory. Really? Get out of my way, door. Really? That's not safe, is it, people? Whatever. I'm finally here. Where's the bedroom? I can't carry this backpack anymore. Not a bad little place. Can't complain. I'm guessing this is the Johnny John. No? The bedroom. Maintenance progress. This room is isolated for maintenance. For your safety, please do not enter. What? Why? Isn't this my place? And you're telling me right off the bat I can't enter? Alright. That's it. Now I can finally read that letter. Collected the letter. Dear Victoria, I hope this letter finds you well. How are things going? It's been a while since I heard from you, so I decided to send you another letter. You're always in a different place all the time, so it's hard to know your exact address. In your last letter, you mentioned receiving a proposal from a magazine. I hope things are going well. Just don't get discouraged. I know things aren't easy for you, girl, and it's always hard to find opportunity in this type of work that isn't, well, you know, men's magazine. Your friends are always asking about you. You should write to them. I always hear them telling others that you took your car and set off on an adventure to chase your dreams of being a model in the Hollywood movies. Oh, I guess now I know why you don't write to them. You don't want to disappoint them. Mom and Dad are fine. Mom misses you. Dad doesn't talk much about you. You know how he disapproved of your idea, but he still loves you, and I love you too, future Miss America. With all my love from your sister, Lauren. Oh, I miss them all too been on the road for like four hours. I need to take a shower. And here comes the storm. I'm guessing this is the shower. Yep, yeah, can we lock our shower? Nope. Weird doors. Whoa, I don't know if that's good or bad. We could see in the mirror.
Oh no, I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. I'm too scared just sitting here. See what I mean? Here comes something. Am I supposed to be doing something? Am I supposed to just be sitting back? Relax. Oh, just as I sit back to relax, we're done? I see how it is. Ouch! What did I do? Oh, a key? Why the hell was there a key under my map? That's a weird one. Oh, no, I need to go get my clothes from my backpack. Dude, I like that the mirror has the freaking reflection. That's so cool. La 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 Time to get dressed and pretty. Wait, what? Where are my clothes? Are you kidding me? Someone stole my clothes. I haven't I can't have forgot them. This can't be happening. So I'll have to buy something to wear tomorrow. This one in the wash. I think I can wear this one for one more night. We're getting dressed. I was like, what the hell? Damn, dude. Someone stole our clothes. So someone was, I knew I thought I heard someone in their apartment when freaking we were sh bathe showering. It's off. It doesn't look like it has the power button. I need the remote to turn it on. Crap modern TV. <laughs> really? All right. Well, we have that key. So is there anything over here real quick? It's almost empty. I should stay here for more than days. I need to buy something to eat. I think about it later. I'll have some snacks in my backy pack. All right, let's go see if we can use this key on this door. Maintenance, do not enter. I don't care. You think you're going to stop me? No. -uh. How do I use? Ha 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 ha. Oh shit. Oh shit, part two. Is that blood? Oh, it's a hole. That's what I thought at first. And there's my TV remote. Who stole my TV remote? What the hell? A table with tools on it. Really? Just an old ladder. I have to be careful not to end up falling in this hole. Why? Because that's how people are coming into my freaking house? Dude, that's so spooky. I hate these type of games. Where they're freaking stalking you. So what, now I'm supposed to sit down and watch TV? So someone... Oh my god. Hello? Is someone there? Hello? No one down that way? No one down that way? Huh? Wait, what? Someone left me a note on my door. Due to heavy rain, we need to isolate the parking garage to prevent flooding tonight. Everything will be back to normal in the morning. Oh, so it was just maintenance. All right, I guess watch TV now. TV's off. Oh, that's right, I got a... I gotta pull it out. Old school stuff. Wait, what's this note? Is this the note we were read earlier? Yes, that's what I thought. I just went with the double, triple, quadruple. Texas sized, of course, with 48,000 square feet of floor space. And this is also the hangout for a new breed, the urban cowboy. I'll give you my interpretation okay. of the, the urban cowboy. Uh, it's a guy that drives a pickup truck that uh, has a gun rack in the back that uh, usually works the maybe in a chemical plant asleep. or uh, is that what it is? in a regular job somewhere in the city and comes out to Gillies on a Friday and Saturday night, chases the gals with the tight blue jeans on and uh, that type of guy. Yeah, I guess this is what we were supposed to.
Damn, I must have fallen asleep. Yo ho 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 ho, what am I supposed to do now? I'm so scared. Go check my bedroom, I guess. Is there anything over here? I don't need anything. Oh my god, dude! Stop with this. Yes? Is it maintenance? Do you got the parking garage fixed, sir? 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 Weird. Thought I heard someone knocking on my door. Are you kidding me? It's not over with. My arms. I can't move them. Did he cut them off? Oh my god! Oh my god! We gotta get out of here! He's burying us alive! Oh no, he's drowning us! Oh crap, come on, come on! Come on! It was inevitable, we're just gonna drown! Crazy. I thought it was done with. Oh my god. Dude. Save? Yes. Dusty old machine, I have no idea what it's for. It does seem to have a chain making it work. I better not touch it while it's in motion. I like how it's a fake window. Alright, so I do have a run button still. Here we go, people. Try to escape. The what the fuck? Fudges this room. This is not at all what I was expecting. This is a setup. Doors locked from the other side. That one's just gone. Yes, this is a total setup. <gasps> I seen that last second and then I fell in. Now we're gonna die. Can I jump? No, so you had to fall. I was gonna say, I didn't think I could. Audition. All the spotlights are on you. You're the actress. And your fans are eager to see your performance. Eyes are watching you from all directions. Live the spectacle. Something is necessary to give your life for the theater. Complete your scene. And you're one step closer to becoming an actress. Fail. And nobody will miss a minute of the actress. <laughs> you know what I mean? Alice chases the rabbit through the forest until she fell into the hole. She now found herself in a room with a small door. But Alice wonders how she can manage to fit through it. This challenge still needs to be solved. <laughs>
painkillers? What's this for? Seems like it's some kind of painkiller. Reduction in combat of physical and mental distress. Increases in serotonin and neuroadrenaline levels to combat mental distress and stabilizes the individual along with other substances. For mood stabilization and anxiety relief, combats physical medical pains and aids in the healing and recovery of the individual, sharpens their senses, brings about a temporary ultra-focused effect. The side effects, the organism rejections may cause hallucinations, numbness, and in long-term significant loss in vocal cords, panic attacks, seizures, and psychosis. Note to self, do not take this. Yoink! Alright, so we made it through the first level. It's missing the outer part. I might be able to unlock it if I reach inside. Do I want to reach inside? No, not right now. What's this door? It's locked. That's all we know. Alright, let's play the radio. Oh, it's a night was attacked by a masked man armed with a knife. She hit the man in the eye with a pen knife and managed to escape alive. Suspect standing at approximately six feet five inches tall. Dude, does anybody else get serious man hunt? Feels on this, I love it. Alright, so now we have to walk across a beam with freaking poles against this our script. The rabbit seems restless, euphoric, frequently checking his watch as he ran through the valley of uncertainty. After crossing paths with Alice, his instinct was to run faster and faster. The more he ran, the more distorted the sound seemed, the more distorted the surroundings appeared. Until the blink of an eye, an obstacle appeared in his path. Only the rabbit's scream echoed could be heard by Alice. Soon a lesson she had learned. When a fragile body has to run, it can only bring more obstacles. To come. Sorry, I just felt like I needed to rhyme there. So I'm guessing I need to run across this is what I'm reading. Alright everyone, wish me luck that I am right. Because if I'm wrong, we're dead tonight. No. You die. What a waste of time. Your death was insignificant. Oh my god! Run! What the hell? Oh my god, dude, did you see that something behind me? One, seven, five, four. One, four, five, seven. One, four, five. Oh! Oh my god, dude. So we're gonna have a limited amount of time to figure out a freaking code? No. One, four, five, seven. I don't like this. Goodbye, everybody. We collected a small key. There's another piece of the script stuck on the door. Alice found herself trapped in a world devoid of faith. The sky was falling. She looked all around, but her key had shattered into pieces all around. Her hand had been cut by the first fragment, leaving a blood stain followed by more intense pain from a second fragment that fell near the first one. Her escape was right in front of her while she was consumed by hatred and suffocated by the fragments of her key that seemed to mock her situation. Was it delirium or just frenzy of madness that sighed from this place? Dude, this is the craziest shit. 1457. It looks like a code. Alright, people. We're gonna get killed. Do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. One, four, five, seven. Four, five, seven, one. Seven, one, four, five. One, seven, five. 
screwdriver stuck in the gear. But now we've lost the screwdriver. Alright. So now we have a chain that I don't know what we need to use for. And we got ourselves a machinery key. And we got these, which I'm guessing we're going to have to use at some point. And we're going to go insane when we got to do it. Alright, so we got the chain. I don't know. I feel like, oh, dude, I'm so scared. I don't know what to do. Handle is screwed up. Must have said it anyway. It fell in. Can I use the chain in here? No, how about you? No. Stab the like button. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.